Hello. Right, I'm back in M back again for another vlog. Oh god, my hands look terrible. Oh god, my headphone head. Right, let's ignore that for a minute because you don't really want to look at my hair anyway, because it's not as interesting as what I'm doing. As they say. Right, what I'm doing today, if you saw my my other video that I recorded, uh, my first vlog video, because I'm jumping on the vlog bandwagon, don't you know? So that'll be interesting to see how this one pans out. I am recording, let me focus on that a bit more. There we go. I'm recording some voice tracking for um, Wednesday, the 25th of May. Uh, we're starting at 8 a.m. in the morning. Um, we'll do a couple of hours worth of voice tracking, then let the uh, system play some tunes without me interrupting them. And then we go back and do some more voice tracking during the day. Now, for all those who don't know what voice tracking is, is it's a way of people cheating in radio. So, um, basically when radio stations want to save a lot of money on having to hire talent, what they do is they get people in to do voice tracking. So, your uh, uh, daytime presenters will do voice tracking for the evening and um, sometimes the evening projectors will do voice tracking for the morning. What voice tracking is, is it's like a live radio show. Everything's recorded in one take. There's no perfectionist involved. And basically what you do is you, you select the two tracks, you hit the record button, and the system, being very clever that it is, records your voice in between two songs, mixing everything together, makes it sound like it's live when it's not. Um, and then um, if you're really, really good at voice tracking, people don't know the difference unless you're as stupid as i am and you've just told everybody who's watching this video on youtube if you look at the little counter below you'll know how many people now know what voice tracking is kind of stupid but there you go it's the secret of radio because let's face it we can't be sitting in front of a radio desk every single hour of every single day doing presenting and um because that's just ludicrous it costs radio stations huge amounts of money but i babble in on so let's crack on with this one and i'll show you how voice tracking works and how i do it now the software i'm using today is the ml list um automation software great bit of software very very professional very rich feature rich very very powerful and uh, a very a very top end software but surprisingly enough it isn't that expensive compared to other radio automation softwares like zeta master control and um, some of the other bigger ones as well um, some like myriad ma list is very affordable very powerful and also unlike some of the other softwares it is more frequently updated with new features bug fixes and um, supports a wide range of equipment Right, that's boring, but I need to explain that so those of you in the audience who like the techie stuff um, now know the techie stuff. Incidentally, if you want me to do more videos on techie stuff to do with um, automation software, how radio works, all this, that and the other, um, just leave a comment in the uh, comments below and um, we'll see what we can put together for you. Okay. Right, now we're doing some voice tracking. Let's get the camera around a bit, a bit more so you don't see my face so much. Now I'm in my home studio at the moment, um, so I've got a very basic setup, well basic as far as radio is concerned anyway, but still sounds bloody professional which is all good. Um, as you know this little thing that I've got jammed in my ear roll here, this uh, white cable here is my headset for my iPhone 6s Plus, I'm hoping to get that replaced with a proper cable that will feed everything from my desk straight into the iPhone for doing the vlogs. Um, but in the meantime we're just going to um, Basically, I've got my Behringer DT770 Pro headphones on. These are the ones I use uh, for radio. I've also got the DT100s I use for studio and ex exterior work. Uh, these ones stay at home because they're quite expensive. Um, yeah, so what I've done is I've jammed the earpiece in the headset. And, um, and basically that means that now I can... Uh, record everything that goes through the headphones straight into the phone but unfortunately you might hear some weird background noises as the headphones move can't really help that but hopefully i'm going to replace this fudger you know scooby-doo setup with a um, with a decent cable in the not too distant future but we'll see anyhow right um this is really annoying because i'm watching myself on video and seeing all these notifications popping up from instagram and facebook it looks really stupid right okay um, right, so this is how we're going to do our voice tracking. What we need to do first of all is we need to select, when you get on mic in the right position, we need to select uh, the two tracks we're going to do 
a voice back track between. Uh, now on my station I have a nice little top of the hour jingle that's kicked off, sounds really awesome. Uh, that sounds like this. Oh actually you can't hear that can you because it comes through the um, speakers and not this. Duh. Anyhow that comes through the um, that comes through the headphones. Uh, it sounds really awesome. Um, I can actually play that. Hang on a second. Let's play. Let's play it. Love dance music. Go. Love sumo online around the world. Sumo Radio UK. Right, and that's my top of the hour jingle. And then we go into two adverts. Um, Got to pay the bills after all, you know. I only do two adverts. I don't do an advert break every twenty minutes like you hear on commercial radio. I only do two. Two adverts, top of the hour. That's it. Um, I believe in the user experience, so I'm very careful with that sort of stuff. Anyhow, I'm rabbiting on with five minutes into this video already. I've got to get cracking. Right, okay, so what we do is uh, we go top of the hour jingle, two adverts, another little jingle, and then we go straight into the first track. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to shove my first voice track in between Neuro on Pure Morning Dew, which is my first tune, and the second tune in the hour, which is Calvin Harris, I'm Not Alone, absolutely amazing, from 2009, we'd like that one. And um, that should sound pretty awesome. That's going to play at 8 o'clock in the morning. So if you happen to be awake at 8 a.m. tomorrow morning, sorry, 8 a.m. Oh, tomorrow morning, what I'm talking about, 8 a.m. on Wednesday the 25th of May, um, 8 a.m. UK that is, by the way, um, then tune in to sumoradio.uk forward slash live, that'll take you straight to the player, and you'll be able to hear my voice that I'm about to record go out on air. So, yeah, that'd be pretty mental, wouldn't it? Unless, of course, this is the future, and then you've missed it, so tough. But you can listen to Sumo Radio anyway, because it's an awesome station. It's my one, so why not? Right, so here we go, a little bit of voice tracking. So we selected two tracks we're going to do our voice tracking on, so Neuron Pure and Kelvin Harris. We hit the VT button. That brings up our voice tracking window, which is what this little thing is. At the top here we have Morning Dew. It's going to play the outro of that, last few seconds of that. And then um, I can then trigger manually the Kelvin Harris track, which is in the B below it. Um, and then that will start playing the Kelvin Harris. And then we have right at the bottom here, we have the M channel. So we have A, B, and M. And M channel is my microphone. You can see the little VU bars on the screen. If you, um, whoa, big finger. If you look at the little VU bars, they're going up and down. That's my voice going through the desk. Okay, so you can hear my voice going through the desk, and that's what the system is going to record. Now, when I trigger the plays and the stops or anything like that, or the records, uh, the system's going to remember at what point I triggered those. It's going to remember their timings, and then it's going to add that to the playlist so that everything plays in time with the way I've actually triggered it now, which is the clever bit. So here we go. This is me voice tracking between two tracks for 8 a.m. 25th of May 2016. I don't know how far in the future this video is going to go, but just thought I'd mention that. And you will hear everything go off perfectly um, without any cock ups of its luck. So here we go. The absolutely amazing Neura on Pure Morning Dew, right here on Sumo Radio. Can you stay? And that's it. That's how you do it. So what we're going to do is we're going to check how that sounds like. Um, how that sounds like. That's amazing English, that is. Uh, we're going to check how that sounds like um, in the mix. So The absolutely amazing Neuro on Pure Morning Dew, right here on Sumo Radio. Can you stay up for the See, weekend? that's pretty cool, that, isn't it? I'm blaming God for looking too old. We like that. That's good. So, um, and that is basically how you do voice tracking on the MLS software. So I'm going to crack on and do a few more of these, and uh, maybe I'll record a few more in the next vlog video. But for now, this is me saying toodles.